more I journal, the more ideas I develop. And it just shows you like the more you draw, like the more creativity is inspired and the better artist you'll become. Hello, my name is Claire Parker. I go to Queen Anne's County High School. I'm attending Pratt Institute in the fall for illustration. I've earned over $100,000 in scholarships and I'm excited to go to art school. Yeah, let's, let's start with your favorite book. How about that? Favorite page? Favorite page Ooh. Okay, I really like mm, these studies because I always reference them whenever, like, especially just doing portraits. This is one of my first journal pages where I learned how to do like contour studies, learning the form of objects. Um, this was a starting point where I then developed into more complex objects. Shown in here, I this was the beginning of my still life and different hatching and cross hatching techniques. I love it. Ever since I started journaling with um, hatching, I've never really done it before, but it helped me develop like bigger art artworks like this one. After several like foundational studies, I started getting inspiration from other artists, and this is where I started to concept build. This is the start of my AP portfolio based on the effects of consumerism and the environmental impact. Um, I took a lot of notes of just like different facts and like what I wanted to incorporate in my art. And here we have some thumbnails of a larger piece I did. But like similar how an engineer has their like notebook, they write in pen so they can never realize like the initial like start of their concept. And it's just so cool to see how they grow over time. As I flip through, you can see like the more words, more different like connections being made. This is a big mixed media piece I made. The more I experiment with materials, the larger my knowledge expands on the art world and it makes me a better artist and more knowledgeable, which makes it easier to create artworks too. And there's this like similar um, pattern of just like tearing apart, like feeling disconnected from the world you used to live in. And this shows that visual journaling can really help you understand more about yourself and the struggles you face. And looking back on it, it shows like how you overcome it with individuality and learning to accept yourself and your ideas, which is the reason I like being an artist is because I feel valuable no matter like how different I am from the rest. That's powerful. That's a beautiful thing. Thank you. What advice would you have for someone just getting started? One course? of the biggest obstacles is insecurity and developing concepts is going to be the hardest part always because like it, it just takes so much thought but once you get the skills to like and you like learn to grow your knowledge on the art world and educate yourself on like everything like you feel passionate about that's going to help you make like whatever you want because art is fueled by inspiration and as long as you have that inspiration you keep educating on yourself on the things that you feel passionate about like art's gonna come easy to you one day this is a recent journal page of a concept building of a bigger artwork i made it all started with um, a mouse i struggled to let go and i tied that into my personal life of like letting go of people that like kind of brought me down and this falcon sweeping in is kind of like the hope, all the things that keep me going, such as art and like everything I care about, like the environment. And it kind of just shows like, it, as long as you stick to yourself, like there's always gonna be a way out no matter how, how hard things are gonna be. <laughs> so this journal page, and this one evolved into this piece. It kind of shows the more you practice techniques, um, you can just apply them without drawing them for the first time. I want to show two more artworks that kind of show journal pages. So right here are my thumbnails for my Prophet City piece. 
right. You see how all these hatching and cross hatching exercises translate into like this bigger composition? This just shows how you need to like create the connections like in your brain, like how shadows can be translated into different shading techniques. And just by practicing, you can create something beautiful. No problem.